it's Ashley from Bacolics Anonymous, and this is a unboxing of Cherry Wallace's a curate, Curation of Magical Curiosities, the Christmas edition, and I know it's a couple days late, but I ordered this the, on the second round, um, so it's just now getting to me, but I'm really excited that I ordered it because all the unboxings I've seen are awesome and so yeah I know what's in it but that's why I or that's why I ordered it because I loved everything pretty much that was in it so if you haven't seen it let's just get right into it so I there was two different ones there was a regular and then there was the Maxima and of course I got the Maxima so. we'll go with um, the first thing which was this came with it as well because it wasn't going to fit in it, so we'll open it first, maybe, if I can get to it. So, this is the Yule Ball poster, and it is gorgeous, and you guys, it's just beautiful. This is, at the first one stroke, lead your partner to the dance floor. At the second one stroke, Yule Beverage will be served. At the third one stroke, Yule Feast will be served. At the fourth one stroke, Witch and Wizard of the Ball will be announced. At the sixth one stroke, final Yule Dance, then good night to all our very special guests. At the fifth, oh, I totally missed the fifth one first. At the fifth one stroke, Yule Parade of Wands Skills. Strictly dressed to impress, see Professor Professor McGonagall for details. And you guys, this is beautiful. I don't know where I would post it, but it's beautiful. We'll stick that right back in there so you don't want to ruin it. And we'll get right into the goodies. Sorry if the lighting sucks, kind of. So the first thing is this little Christmas card that says, Ooh, Happy Christmas, Neville. It says, Dear friend, I couldn't risk sending Hedwig ever since the World Cup. <coughs> the ministry's been intercepting more and more owls, and she's too easily recognized. Sirius Black. That reminds me, did you feed the owl upon arrival? It's quite cold this winter, and it's flown quite the journey to get to you. I can't believe the festive season has arrived. It's the most wonderful time of the year, don't you think? This year has been filled with such magic and our community is thriving. Our wizarding world has some of the most incredible, passionate, and kind-hearted wizards and witches within it. And I'd like to say a huge thank you for all of your support with the curation of magical curiosities this year. And it says, I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year. Always cheery. So it's a very beautiful. <clears throat> and... Here is this lovely wrapped packaging. And like I said, I know what everything is, but still, it's so pretty and wrapped and lovely. I suck at wrapping, just FYI. is the lovely Weasley scarf that Miss Weasley made for the twins in the fifth book. I'm just a blank here. But it is so pretty and it's lovely. Not that I would have a whole lot of use for it in Texas, but I still wanted it because it's still gorgeous. <clears throat> the next. Oh. 
Next thing is in this lovely little packaging. This beautiful little glass bottle. And so here's the little topper. Looks like a pumpkin. And it's just beautiful blue bottom. I don't know where I would put it, but I don't even care. It's gonna go back in the little bottle for now. Oh, it's like a fit came out. The next thing we have is in this little box with the queen crown on it. I love her packaging. And it is in this little, this, I love this. When I saw it, I thought it was the very cute replica. It is the queen chess piece from the wizarding chess. Look, it's so detailed and it's beautiful. anything and then we have this little packaging it says Owl Post Service September 91 and this I love this too this is the Rememberal turns red if you forget something and the detail on it is gorgeous as well you guys <laughs> the next thing is this that says happy christmas harry happy christmas ron their gloves. One for Ron. One for Harry. Yes, and they fit nice and they're warm. Again, not much use for them in Texas. They are gorgeous. This adorable enamel pin. It's got the Hogwarts H, it's got the golden snitch, it's got a lightning bolt, um, the little Deathly Hollows, and a little jewel for each of the house. You can't really see all well, that well. Again, my lighting sucks. It's a gorgeous pin. In this little box, we have adorable ornaments. Adorable key ornaments. It's got the little wings. It's beautiful. Here. 
know if that's going to keep unwrapping itself. But, and it's got the little definitely hollow symbol up there. I love keys, like any kind of keys. I have two or three key necklaces that my husband's given me. I just, I love them. So I love this. We get this Chudley Cannons uh, foam flag like thing that um, is like a replica that Ron has in his above his bed or something, if I'm not mistaken. I have tons of different little flags like this that say different things, but I like that. It's cute. And then we have. Very pretty shiny envelope. Which has this gorgeous Yule Ball invitation, guys, that's like foiled, go foiling, and it opens up and it just, it is beautiful. It says, To be held at 1900 hours Christmas Day at the Great Hall, Hogwarts School. It says, Hogwarts School of Witchcraft, Witchcraft and Wizardry, together with the Ministry of Magic, requests the pleasure of your company at the Yule Ball to celebrate Christmas and the Triwizard Tournament. At 21.30 hours, the traditional champions waltz, strictly dressed to impress. So, that is gorgeous. And just... Mm. Beautiful. Yes, I'm to die. I'm so loving these things. I see, I was a little jealous of everyone that got theirs because I didn't think I would be able to get one, but it came back and I'm so happy for um that it came. And of course this last thing is a picture of of a howler. And this is artwork by Cherry Wallace herself, and it is gorgeous. And yes, I'm just all for everything. And then we have the sheet that has everything on it, and it just, like I said, I loved everything on it, or in the box, so I knew I had to get it. Um, if you guys have any questions or whatnot, let me know, and I would be glad to answer them. Bye, guys.